So, um, in all different states around the country, we've had to deal with the fact that it's been a year of extremes. In our part of the world, and in fact, I think in your part of the world, certainly on KI, we saw it, big bushfires. Uh, that's because the planet is in a climate crisis and getting a little warmer, even though some people don't want to acknowledge that fact. Then we had a brief period of flood, uh, following upon which, with a backdrop of an American president that was delusional, nasty, probably the worst we've ever seen. Actually, a movie could not have made him look like a bigger dickhead, is the truth. And I'm sure there are gonna be many, many movies about the dumpster, oh my God. I wish Netflix had not been invented for that, anyway. Uh, but we saw him off, or they saw him off, just, whew. and then of course the <laughs> pandemic. And it seems like nowhere has the fear of the pandemic struck more than in South Australia. <laughs> I mean, you're very careful around here, I can tell you that. We have got you so separated out there in your chairs and your aisleways and everything that, well. Anyway, WOMAD had to happen. We wanted to come back. It's one of our favourite festivals. And you should be coming on Monday night too because we've got some very special people playing with us on Monday. But tonight, oh, they've gone. Uh, I'll introduce them a little bit later on. Uh, Leah Flanagan and Liz Stringer are up on stage singing with us. 
Uh, as some of you will know, uh, who followed the band closely, uh, we did lose our dear departed brother on bass, Bonesy Hillman, uh, not that long ago, and it was... Thank you, and it was a particularly difficult time um, for everybody close to him. Uh, please make Adam Anshira welcome on the stage for filling in and doing the bits and pieces he needs to do. I'll talk about that a little bit later on. And uh, what else can I say? Linda and Vicar, fantastic. I mean, they have been sitting behind Paul Kelly for I don't know how many years. It was time that they got 20 feet from the back of the stage to the front. That's all I can say. We've got a whole bunch of songs for you tonight, so, um, and I think, are you allowed to dance? Yes! yes. I'm glad to hear that, because guess that, that's what, that's what humans in Adelaide do on a night out like this. <laughs>
and dearest swinging our way through the hills and of course at this stage of the game if you get lucky enough to last long enough to be able to think backwards as well as forwards concentrating on where you're putting your feet at that particular moment by thinking yep. to yourself as you came past the scungiish looking pub that looks awfully like the Arca bar <laughs> and then heading out towards the airport that reminds me of the Thebi theatre and then out of the hotel room, I believe I can see a certain tennis court down there. And many other places, Adelaide and South Australian people, that we have developed our relationship over the years. And there are many things you can say about it. And we're on a time limit tonight, so we won't get a chance to say all of them. But one of them is that we like to rock. <laughs> Watching a 
expression Don't waste your time Can't wait for the end of the session
having a bit of fun tonight. You can see that we haven't played for 18 months. Hey, so because um, one of the things that we're doing, we're doing two shows because they couldn't get international people, many international people to come and play. So uh, we played here, I think, many years ago and at different times we've come down. There's something about the ethos of the festival that we really like. We spent a little bit of time with Peter Gabriel back in the day and uh, we like the fact that lots of different kinds of music get around that might not get around elsewhere. That's, that means you have a fertile music which is good for everybody, music fans and everybody else. Anyway, uh, so we're doing a big thing on the Maharada live record on Monday, which um, is, a, is a project that we're really very, very pleased to get out the door and uh, we'll be joined by many of our First Nation friends and colleagues when we do that. But tonight we are joined on stage uh, by two of the people who will be joining us on that night as well, five singers and musicians in their own right. Please welcome Leah Flanagan and Liz Stringer joining us here tonight. Thank you. I know you can do a little bit better than that. Just, just pretend. Yes, come on. Yeah. Just imagine you're ordering a souvlaki down the other end of Hyde Street, okay? And you have to shout to make yourself heard.
screams in a second and you know what the miracle of technology means that you can actually use it now if you get your mobiles out you jump into it you follow the prompts you sign the Uluru statement from the heart fantastic on the wall digital peti petition and then Australia finally gets one thing really right which is making peace with the first people that were here making sure they have a voice in the Constitution a treaty no doubt and a fantastic platform for everyone under the ages of 25 or 30 to build a great country Come on. 
singing about so many things in so many different ways for us hoping that you and other people that we play to will get to it and will join one another in stuff that they do and humans are interesting aren't they you know we tend to forget once the pain has receded a little bit once the drama's moved on we tend to forget but the big changes are made by those who don't forget the big changes are made by those who determine that they're going to do something good for the place however corny it may sound at the time. The big changes are made by those who do not have a short memory. <laughs>
says give that not Trenches all in rows. Bombs and threats still ask for more. down the front to sing some songs as well. As the wind blows in from the western desert and the fish and chip shop down in Victor Harbour is just closing up for the night. <laughs> and the nippies is quietly lurking in the freezer of the Coles 24 hour petrol station on the way down to Seduna. I can imagine it all, to be honest, every bit of it.
darkness over Charleville, the fires begin to glow. Yeah. 